Hi, I'm Ken Lund. I'd like to tell you about machine quilting uh, with my quilt frames and how tight do you need to stretch your quilt for machine quilting. Well, guess what? You really don't need it drum tight. Why is this? Well, let's think about it. Um, if you didn't have a frame set up and you were, you were manu uh, maneuvering your quilt by hand, you'd probably be using the little utility gloves with the rubber nubs, right? It helps you grip the quilt and run it around. Well, the quilt then, it's not stretched, is it? No, it's not. Uh, it just has the layers uh, basted together, maybe spray basted, maybe uh, pinned or something here or there. So, do you need to stretch it drum tight? No, you don't. In fact, I wouldn't stretch it real tight because of this. Your quilt top is made of many different pieces of fabric cut on different ways of the fabric. It's not all on the bias. It's not all one direction. Um, and you also, you have seams and such. So if you were to stretch it really tight and then you have your, your backing stretch really tight and you sew it all together, then you have a finished piece that's actually sewn under tension. What happens when you wash it? Oh boy, shrinkage, tension, you guess. Try a little one and see, it's a mess. So, with my frames, they're really simple. Mount it to the rolls. Just make sure that it's taut, even. Uh, maybe a stretcher clip from side to side. You just want it to help hold level, flat, and smooth. That's the function of a machine quilt frame. And you will come out with beautiful projects every time. Please tell your friends about my frame kits. They're super economical. In fact, lately I've had many people say, wow, thanks. We've paid for our whole setup after just our first large quilt uh, versus sending it out to be machine quilted. Plus, you can get results that are so superior to uh, long arm quilting. You get really beautiful artisan stippling of work and you just sit and work with your project much the same you would as when you're piecing your top together. If you want a truly beautiful artisan work and you want to be able to easily do it, my frames are perfect for beginners or experts. So thanks so much for watching one of my quick tips.